Hey guys, and welcome back to episode 17 of my Cottage Living Rags to Riches Let's Play. Lacey's currently eating her breakfast, and yes, I know it's leftover Thanksgiving dinner, but she's living her best life. So today, I think we are going to take care of our farm like we normally do, get everything kind of situated. Oh, I don't know what that noise was for. Oh. Our, one of our chicks hatched, I think. That's cool. Let's see if another rooster chick. <laughs> That's fine. Because we can always trade it for stuff. But, um. Let's check in on this chicken's day. I think we're pretty good. We have no. We do not know this brown hen. So maybe we can give a friendly treat to it and socialize with it, give it some love, show some dance moves. And then I wanna be better at going around and giving my chickens the fishy protein treat. Oh, what did that say? While removing reeds, Lacey found a new frog. Okay. Let's see, the black hen, I did not. So we're gonna give this black hen a fishy protein treat as well. Because I need to be better at doing that. And it looks like our aubergines are coming in and are gonna be white, so that'll be interesting. Oh, and I guess we have some gifts. I guess let's invite him in. And the pub owner is here as well. We can also scatter some feed nearby. And we need to give Bertha a fishy protein treat as well. So right now they're both gonna, I think all the chickens will lay a fishy, or lay a second egg next round. Um, let's also harvest this crop. That is a huge pumpkin. Oh, Rahul is calling us. He wants to go out on a date with us. Well, our farm looks pretty well taken care of, so maybe we can go. That was very unexpected. We do have a little bit of romance with him, but not enough to where I thought he would ask us out on a date. He did take us to the store, but let's just talk to him a little bit. Maybe compliment his appearance. Talk about the rain. Maybe give him a little bit of a hug. Maybe we should go like stand inside. There's not really a good place. Oh, I guess our date is over at the top corner. So maybe we just get to know him a little bit more and flirt with him, have an inside joke. He loves the outdoors, which is perfect. Flirt with him again. Maybe flatter him. How much do we know about him? Loves the outdoors and nothing else. There's also like 10,000 people in this store. <laughs> so it's not a very romantic first date location, but it, I guess it is public. I 
And then maybe we can ask him about day. And discuss his interests. Oh, I guess he he left. So apparently our date wasn't going that well. <laughs> or maybe he had to go to work. We'll just say he had to go to work. So let's go back to Hunford on Bagley. We didn't collect all of our harvest bubbles for the day, so we can't go into town yet. But that was a cute little date. Actually, no, it wasn't. I don't know what I'm talking about. That was a terrible choice of location on his part. And then we'll weed all and water all. And I don't think we have any like fun milks in here. I think we just have like regular milk. Yep. So we don't need to put that in the competition. Let's breed these frogs. What do we get? A new type of frog. Sunflower frog. Sell that frog. Okay. So I think today we're just going to try to make a little bit more money and then maybe at the, towards the end of this episode we'll renovate the house a little bit just to make it a little bit bigger since we have a little bit more money to spend. Also we need to get another plant growing here ASAP so maybe a mushroom. That's all clean. Oh, this needs to be cleaned. And let's give Daisy another friendly treat and shear her wool. We got a super vitality fertilizer, so maybe we can fertilize this with that. And I really want to encourage crop growth as well. Kim Bloom, Gold Bloom would like to come over? No, we're gonna have to go over there. Who is Broderick Lentz? Um, under what conditions? Oh, I guess we just got $2,500. So now we're making a lot of money, so we have enough to renovate the house. If we want. Also, we can buy a wild rabbit home to help us out a little bit. Oh, I didn't mean to click that. Let's go in here and get a wild rabbit home then. Since we're friends with the wild rabbits, maybe we can put it just like over there so that it's kind of okay. And let's collect the eggs. Let's go into town just to finish off some of those errands we have to do and then we'll come back and we will update our house a little bit. Okay. So let's go. Oh, we can already sell them for 10%. Let's try to haggle and see if we'll get even more because we have our big pumpkin to sell. Oh yeah, 25% profit, that's awesome. Okay, so let's click through all of these. I know she needs some mushrooms, so we're not gonna sell any of the mushrooms. Oh wait, 
I just sold, I just said we weren't gonna sell those and then I tried to sell them. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna have a lot of money. We're keeping the raspberry jam. I really should have put the raspberry jam. Actually, we can sell the cross the tube for more than we bought it for, so we're gonna sell it. And I keep saying we're gonna try canning, so maybe I'll save some of the tomatoes again to try canning. And then let's give her her lovely and spicy mushrooms. I hope that's all we had to do. Yep, perfect. And then we need to find Agnes Crumplebottom. Oh, look at this, this is cute. This is the new fair. Agatha Crumplebottom. Let's invite to hang out at current lot because we need her. She'll be right over. So I think she'll spawn in here. Report gnome gossip. Do I know then these people? I do. I can just ask him for the juicy gossip too. That'll be great. Okay. And then we can report on single sims. Yep, okay. We got the juicy gossip. Let's find the mayor. At this rate, we're gonna have to... Oh, she's literally right there. We can report the juicy gossip. Then we can offer help with errands. Did we not finish this one? Where's Agatha? And we'll report on single sims. Oh, Carl gave us some stuff. Oh, it's almost my birthday. An upgrade part for an animal shed. I think that's what we're gonna try to aim for. Okay. No, we need to report on single sims. Oh, now we have to deliver a dessert. Okay, that's fine. We can ask the mayor if she, I think she only has that winning first place thing. So maybe we can ask our friend Rahul if he has anything for us. Having more Henford heart to hearts. Which we can, that one's more simple, but we have a lot of money and we don't have anything to enter into this festival. So I think we should head home and update our house a little bit. Okay, let's see what we can do here. I think we can make this room a little bit bigger. Actually, no, I like the size that it is. Maybe I should just start over and move all the stuff outside. I like the idea of having like a front door and like a side door. So maybe we'll do that. And I would like her bedroom to be over here. It doesn't have to be huge though. But then this makes the house a weird shape with where I have the bathroom set up. Unless I add like a second bathroom here, but then it's also still a very weird shape. Unless I move 
this one here. But I don't think we need two bathrooms. Let's see. This roof is definitely, definitely gonna have to change. Oh, see, I liked the roof. Oh, not like that. <laughs> I liked the roof where it was because it gave me more room. So maybe we just make that. Okay, I see what I can do is make this a little like half bath. And then extend this out to there and make that bathroom connected to her bedroom. So, we can do that. Add like a little window. Put that one down. And that one that will be over like her bed area I like that the idea of that one there oh maybe we could put this on the front on her bedroom I like that one better it's kind of high though We can keep that up and put like the kitchen in this corner. So, oh, I don't wanna put that there. Put that there. Maybe she can have the same light in her bedroom and this same light in her bathroom. Maybe she'll have two lights in her bathroom though, just to make it a little bit brighter. Okay, this flooring will continue through the house, make sure it's the same angle. Actually, let's make it morning a little bit just so we have a little bit more light. Actually, let's go in live mode and turn on all lights just so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, put that there. can get this little sink for in here. I feel like we need another window in this bathroom, but I don't like having two of those at the same spot. So maybe we can, they're not the same color. They're not the same color. Maybe we can do like one of these B windows or something just to change it up. And then I like this wallpaper, so we'll just keep that going through her room. Let's get the new bed and put it in there as well. So let's see what colors we can do with that. I like that one, so that'll be nice. Let's see the new nightstands as well. We can put the kitchen. I don't like putting those right next to each other. Maybe we need to move where that door to her bedroom goes because it 
and we can move this to the middle and put the kitchen on this side of the house oh but then it, it should be fine um still not happy with that so maybe it'll go on this side And we can sell this bed since we no longer have a use for it. I want this sink under here. Uh, maybe I will change to this green to go with everything else. Put the corner piece in. Yeah, I like that a lot better. Uh, maybe, is there an end piece that can go there? Uh, I think that little weird sp space that's left is weird, so. We'll do that. And then maybe we can get like a little dining table in here, like a circular one. There's this one from the pack. I could use like a bigger one, but we don't have a lot of people right now, so. We could literally put it there and put two chairs and that would be fine because we don't have any friends that come over to eat either, which is sad, but it's true. So we can just stick that in the corner. And... The only thing we don't have is like a little place to put trash cans. So maybe I'll move that back to where it was and put a trash can in that little corner over there. Let's see. Put a white one. That looks a little too modern though. Maybe she'll have something like this. I'll put that in the corner. Okay, now we also need to finish off this other bathroom here. So we'll put a sink like that and we'll do maybe a little bit better quality toilet. Like that. Okay. So now let's turn all these lights back to all the auto. I think it looks good from the outside. Oh, maybe we can actually put another one of these windows. Oh, maybe not that one. Maybe the other side. Over here, just to put another window on there. And then I think I never finished the roof. That's exactly what I thought was gonna happen. But I'd never put a front door at the front. So we're gonna continue to use the side door for now, but maybe we can have one of these roofs. Cause I like the idea of that sloping off of it. And then we'll have this one go this way. And poke into it like that. But then we have the problem of the roof. So we'll just duplicate it and tuck it away like that. And I think we need to, oh, it's still sticking out. Okay. Now we need to change the color to that. And I think that looks good. Okay. 
And I think we're going to end that part here. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I appreciate you guys tuning in. Subscribe if you're new. And have a great day.